Now in 2021, NTV brought you the story of Nicholas Kirui, a teacher who was being accused of being sexually involved with a student. The said student came forward to clarify that the claims she made were false and made out of duress from the then head teacher. Now despite this, Nicholas was not reinstated by the Teacher Service Commission in a battle which the English teacher took to the courts to win his job back. NTV has kept tabs on Nicholas since 2021 and can now tonight report that the courts have cleared him of any wrongdoing. The focus now shifts to the TSC to see if he will be reinstated. Gina Kirori reports. The TSC account directors, the HR Kanyambia, Kunakezi, Meloji, Wapale, and the principal, Akasema Kwamba. Kulikuwa na usiano na mstana wa ile shule ambao nilitoka. Jambo ambao haikuwa ya ukweli. It is the phone call that would turn Nicholas Kilonzo's world upside down in 2019. The teacher of English who is a father and a husband had just started work at a new station after being transferred from a school in Kitui. However, before he could settle into his new station, he got the call that he had been implicated in a case where a student at his former school accused him of having relations with her. In 2021, NTV tracked down the girl in question and her family to find out her side of the story. She admitted that she made the whole thing up. The then teenage girl pointed a finger at the head teacher of Kakaini Mix Secondary School in Kitui as the person responsible for forcing her to bring the damning allegations against Kilonzo. We also contacted him for his response. The best thing that you can do was to report up. And follow due process, Kilonzo did, as he presented evidence to TSC, including a sworn and recorded statement from the teenage girl and her guardian, who confessed that she was forced into making the statement about Kilonzo. Nicholas Kilonzo also filed a case in court in a bid to win his job back, which he had lost due to the claims. The court has finally declared Kilonzo innocent, clearing him of any wrongdoing. But that is not all. The court has directed that Kilonzo be paid damages for the losses he has suffered since 2019 due to lack of employment, court and legal fees, among other costs. It is a win for the teacher who describes his experience as tumultuous, more so for his family and reputation, which he says has taken a serious beating due to the false claims. The ball is now in the Teacher Service Commission's court to see if they will reinstate the embattled teacher. Ngena Kirori, NTV.